Yes, uh, we haven't done any football here, but this is kind of comical. And it's to me, it's I don't know what the point is, but it'll get a lot of publicity. The New England Patriots will sign Tim Tebow and have him in their minicamp. Now, why? I'll tell you why. Because Urban Meyer coached Tim Tebow. Bill Belichick and Urban Meyer are very close friends, and this is a favor to Tim Tebow and a favor to Urban Meyer. Because if Belichick brings him in, it gives him complete credibility. And you know what? It'll allow people in the league to get on ESPN tonight and get on football shows and tell you how Bill Belichick will reform Tim Tebow when it is the dumbest thing that anybody will ever come up with. They will tell you that he's going to revolutionize the game. He'll come up and he'll do this. Tom Brady won't let him near the huddle. Okay, and he's not a quarterback. And if you make him a tight end, he'd be about the wor- he'd be about the fiftieth best tight end in the league. So the idea that there's any importance to this, and it will get raging headlines, and it will have everybody, oh, 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 oh my God, how are we going to deal with this? You will never see him do anything for the Patriots. Here's what it says. All right, although the connection between Bill Belichick and Urban Meyer has led the talk in the past, okay? Uh, the fact is, the news still comes as a major surprise. Yeah, I don't know who to who. In recent weeks, most of the talks surrounding Tebow has centered on the idea that Tebow is done in the NFL. Now, uh, Tebow will have a shot to compete for the number two job behind Brady, which is about the same job that the Maytag repairman used to have, which means you do nothing, okay? Nothing. And Bill Belichick likes toys. That's why he had Doug Flutie there late in his career kicking drop kicks. Okay? All he did was he did Urban Meyer a favor and and put Tim Tebow in a place where he could go on to some respect. What would Tim Tebow's job be with the Patriots? He can't run Tom Brady's offense. Here you have one of the great throwing quarterbacks in the history of the league. Tim Tebow and Tom Brady, what do they have in common? Nothing. They're both males. That's it. And they're both in a lot of magazines. Okay, when it comes to playing the quarterback position, they have nothing in common. And if you think he's going to run in and, and he's going to run in and Tom Brady's going to run out of the huddle, you are out of your cotton pick in mind. Who is better historically on third and one in the history of the NFL than Tom Brady? He's about 75 out of 76 on quarterback sneaks. Tim Tebow has an NFL home. They may be looking at him as an occasional wildcat. You think the Pats are going to waste their time with a wildcat uh, wildcat offense when Tom Brady is about the best third and one, four and one quarterback you've ever seen running the sneak? You know what? Other teams will. You know what I would do if I was a defensive coordinator and they took Tom Brady out and put Tebow in? I would cheer. I will send them candy and flowers. If they would take Tom Brady out and put Tim Tebow in. That might be the dumbest thing anybody could ever do. But this will get an incredible amount of publicity because it is the Pats who like to tweak people and make them think about things that have no value. And, of course, it speaks about Urban Meyer and Bill Belichick. And, frankly, a lot of people in the NFL have been expecting it. Because of that relationship. Alberto and River Edge, what's up, Alberto? Along those lines, do you think that uh, that was done purposely to uh, give a little uh, a shot to the Jets? Yes. Okay. Excellent. It always is. <laughs> oh, that's funny as heck. Yes. Hey, uh, and then they'll tell you that he has these wondrous things he can do and everything and this and that, and then he won't do anything all year. Oh, my God. That's funny as heck. Um, I'm sure the folks over at the other network are going absolutely uh, ballistic over it. They must be jumping up and down. Oh, you kidding? This will be okay. this will have people breathless on TV tonight. Oh, yeah. he's there. He's going to be a secret weapon. <laughs> you know, I was uh... one time I can see Tebow running in and Brady getting a big kick out of it is when they play the Jets. They'll probably have Tebow come in. They'll have about four plays designed. You see Tebow in the end zone and the pass will be going crazy on the sideline, especially if it's like forty nothing at the time when he scores. Mike and Hamden, what's up, Mike? Hey, Mike, how you doing? What's up? 
Um, I got four reasons why the Patriots probably signed Tebow. Uh-huh. Um, number one, especially at the start of training camp, this will take away a lot of questions of the loss of Bowker and also Gronkowski's health going into the season. I think. Yeah, that, what, what, uh, exper- how does that? How does that have anything to do with those two things? Is it okay? Get all the beat writers off that question and onto the, you know, more about Tebow, I would think. Okay. But also, uh, with their losses in the playoffs, I think also it adds a special team factor that they might throw out there. And finally. Oh, yeah, because yeah, he was so good on special teams with the, with the, with the Jets last year. It was really such a, he was such he a big factor. <laughs> but in the, finally, um, every team needs a scout team quarterback for the read option now. And he actually fills that void too for the Patriots. Oh so. yeah, that's great. Right. Well, yeah, good because you don't want you want to you want to make sure you have like the most celebrated backup in the world to do that. You know, hey, this is this is to tweak the Jets, and basically it's it's to have a little fun, and also it's to give them an NFL home because Bill Belichick and Urban Meyer are close friends. Nick in Norwalk, what's up, Nick? Flipping through the channels there, and it's uh, the Tebow news is all over the place. Oh the yeah, you kidding? No, this will be, it's, it's be, crazy. You be, and you'll have guys saying this is the best move. He's going to be a dynamic player. Uh, Somebody will have him sharing time with Brady. Yeah, yeah. Um, now Tebow is a Patriot, so I'm sure that will be just breathless for people. Oh Tebow! Oh no! Now he's going to be a secret. This is a guy who most people felt his. Time in the NFL had passed. He was never going to play another down in the NFL. Now that he has joined the Patriots, it'll be like he found Nirvana. That now, yes, he'll be deadly on special teams. And he'll be the second quarterback. And they'll have a wild card package. And on the, they will not. They have Tom Brady. You take Tom Brady out of the lineup? Why? Why would you take Tom Brady out of the lineup? 